The Accounts page on Bankline lets you view your accounts and their balances. Let's take a look at its key features. There are seven different balances available. Using the drop-down, you can choose which to display, up to four at a time, and the display will change in real time. To use this function, your administrator will need to add the View Balances privilege to your roles. For you to be able to display the available funds balance for the accounts, which may allow for greater control of cash flow, they'll need to add the View Available Funds privilege. You can also navigate to view transactions for an account from the Accounts page. To do this, you'll also need the View Transactions privilege and your Bankline Administrator can help with this. If you have many accounts on Bankline, you can use the search function to find an account using its sort code, account number, name, or alias. You can also create an account set, which is a group of accounts to make the management and reporting on account balances easier. You can create personal account sets just for you, or you can create customer account sets, which can be shared with other users on your Bankline profile. You can create multiple account sets to suit your needs, and look at historic balances from the last 15 months. You might have noticed the star icons next to your accounts. Using these stars, you can choose to display up to 20 of your favorite accounts on the dashboard, so they're always close to hand. If you don't see an account in the list, check the account is registered to the profile. If you have the Manage Accounts privilege, you'll see the Register Account button. From here, you can add the missing account. If you don't see the Register Account button, you'll need to talk to your administrator about getting the Manage Accounts privilege, or have them register the account on your behalf. These are just some of the handy things you can do on the Accounts page, and we'll be bringing more enhancements over time. For step-by-step -step instructions on using the features we've shown in this video, Visit our how-to article library by clicking the support button on the dashboard and search what can I do on the accounts page.